welcome back to another video everyone. Um, I want to talk about some strange bugs in Rocket League. So I've had Rocket League open up for a bit. It's taken a lot longer to load and when I am on PC as you can tell. But And um, the other thing as well, it also when I go into the menu it says click anything to start or launch it. it before it would work just fine. Um, now it doesn't and let me give you some ba backstory context so basic so basically uh, I got banned because uh, or banned for a few days for saying something because uh, I kept getting demoed by this one guy I mean in my opinion you really shouldn't have I mean big deal I said it I mean it wasn't the end weird or anything like that it was not that Sorry, I'm logging into school. Anyways, so we're gonna jump into the match, maybe casual 2v2, right? Okay, now watch my clock speeds right at the top. I have my FPS capped at 80 because my, my refresh rate on my monitor is only 75. If I cap it at the refresh rate of my monitor, it, it's weird. See, normally it doesn't do this, right? Bef like originally, it would never kind of like lag like that when I first joined a match. Yeah, I'm pretty bad, so excuse, excuse me for the bad gameplay. I feel like, oh, nice. I'm trying to block the ball, come on. No, no, no. I don't get it why it's not really doing it here, but okay, when the match ended, ended, ends, excuse me, um, I'll send or, or show you the uh, loading time. Oh, nice. Okay, he has a nice, nice, nice. Nice. Oh, I screwed that up. No, no, no. Damn it. I mean, it's fair. They're all just keep on leaving. Oh, nice, dude. Yeah, and these. Oh, wait, that's not AI bot anymore. Alright, screw it. There's no point. Watch. It freezes loading. And look at my clocks. They just freeze as well. Everything freezes whenever I'm loading. And then, as in then afterwards, it takes a while to actually join in, or load in back in the main menu. And then whenever I'm with playing with friends, like the loading, the joining thing shows up because they're trying to join. I mean, I've never had this before. I, I did, I did send my CPU back on auto from the overclock I originally had for, to reduce temperatures, because I was able to reduce, I'm able to get more on my CPU on auto since AMD is, you know, pretty good with their CPUs and getting the most performance out of it on auto and their pushes and boost overdrive stuff. Um, so yeah, I don't understand why it takes that long. It, it's it's weird. Um, but yeah, hopefully you can 
someone can help me, please. It's not, you know, I like to give me, I would like to get our company back to the way it was. Uh, frame rate issue though is none, if you're wondering, okay. You can see it's pretty stable, just those lag spikes and things like that. Um, and also did up my GP, did update my D GPU driver, so that might be another thing, but I don't, I don't know. Anyways, peace out.